Dusty Zim uh, had a couple more loud noises tonight. He's gotten off to a great start to the season. What's maybe the, the biggest positive with him that you've seen in the first couple of weeks? Well, number one, he's healthy and uh, probably pitch selection at the plate, and he's not missing balls. Um, he's, uh, his concentration is, is, is high, and, uh, you know, he feels good about himself, you know. So it's been a la tough last couple of years. And um, but you know, it wasn't only Zim tonight. I mean, it was uh, uh, Strauss threw a heck of a game. You know, he kept us in a position, you know, for Zim to hit the home run. And also um, our defense. You know, I mean, this is what we preach all the time. You know, Anthony made a heck of a play. Uh, you know, Michael made the play of the game because that ball gets by him. You know, that's a that's a that's a triple and. Uh, 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 Eaton made a heck of a play in left field, so you know uh, our outfield defense and and our defense overall was was very good. For uh, for Ali Perez to come in after not pitching 12 days, yeah. face the hottest hitter in the league and, and do what he did. Well, uh, I mean, I told him, I said, Ali, I said, you know, talked to him yesterday. I said, hey man, uh, you're gonna get a lot of work here here soon. Um, Ali knows how to stay ready, and he has a great attitude about staying ready and. Uh, you know, shoot, he had pitched in 10 or 11 days. And, uh, you know, he came in, he threw some strikes. And, uh, I mean, you never want to see Freddie Freeman up there. Uh, but, uh, you know, finally tonight we, you know, corralled Freddie. So now Freddie's somebody else's problem. <laughs> <laughs> For a while. Yeah. You mentioned that play that Michael made. Um, he he kind of has to make a, a call there whether he's going to go all out and, and risk it or, or lay back. Is that well, for an outfielder? How tough of a call is that to make in, in a split second? Well, hey, you got to you got to do it. I mean, either either you stay back and let the ball hit in front of you, or um, you know you come all the way. And uh, for an outfielder, you know the jump is, is is essential. You know that's why Michael was in, in center tonight, and you know Eaton was in left, and. Uh, you know, our, our outfield defense was going to come into play because, you know, Strauss throws a lot of, you know, more fly balls probably than ground balls. And uh, so um, uh, that was an outstanding play as an outfielder. You know, you got to get the jump, uh, especially uh, on a ball like that. And then, and then if you kind of miscalculate how far the ball's going to you, then your next move is to try to figure out how to keep the ball in front of you. And uh, so, I mean, that was an outstanding. Uh, played by Michael and another outstanding play by Eaton in, in left field. Bryce had another hit tonight. Mm -hmm. What is the difference between him this year and, and last year? Is it, is it just the Well, health? you know, he started out great last year as, as well. I think he was player of the month last year in April. And uh, now the, the secret is to keep him strong and, to, you know, uh, um, you know, just it, and keep him healthy. You know, the main difference, I think, is that, you know, he's not missing pitches. You know, he's not following them back. Last year, he's following back a lot of pitches that ordinarily he'd put in play. And, uh, you know, he's taking what they give him. You know, he'll take a single up the middle, and he'll take a, a double down the left field line. And so he's using the whole field, I think, is the difference. What did you uh, think of just Kelly's first outing, you know, mm -hmm. since he was named? Well, you know, I mean, uh, you know, Kel, number one, you got the first out. And, uh, you know, that's always big. Uh, and we still, like I said, we got to keep an eye on, on Kelly. And, uh, you know, we're going to try to, uh, you know, use him as we feel fit to keep him strong. But uh, also that eighth inning was a big inning by Coda. You know, I mean, that was, that was real big, that eighth inning. Um, you, know, you know, facing quality hitters there. Uh, how different has Anthony Rendon looked to you this week, not just at the plate, but in the field compared to maybe the week before? Well, that? you know. Uh, it, it's a daily game, and you know Anthony is Anthony. You know he doesn't. He seems unfazed by if he's doing poorly or you know doing great. You can't. You go to the ballpark. You can't really tell how Anthony's doing. So you know, and, and you know Anthony's going to hit. You know, and, and he's off to a much better start this year than than last year. And I'm hoping he hits his first homer and, and get that out the way in in uh, in New York.